So, yeah, we're gonna do a third one. Recycling your friends! Because it's pre-skull. I want to start with skull. When, when skulls are involved. This one looks complicated. It's like a bunch of little... Well, if it's a bunch of, like, disconnected puzzle rooms, I guess that's fine. Where's Jeff? I can make a zombie here. Is Jeff behind? He sure is. What do you do? You turn off the jam. What do you do? You close the door. Oh, but that removes the spikes. Okay, I cannot do this fast enough. I don't think- I'm not sure how this helps. Like, I can definitely do this! This lets me access to here. And I can go like, Ugh! And not mess it, and now everything is wasted. Question on idle thumbs up, huh? I don't know why that keeps- Okay, no, the flamethrower still goes, even... I thought that's why you would remove the spikes, is to push them around, but it's not working. Wilhelm scream, I already got your Chivo. Oh boy. Nope, like, see- Oh, wait a second, zombie here. Zombie here. I keep just ignoring the zombies here. Let's do this. That's why you're there. That's why you're there. Oh, you burned a zombie. All right, well, whatever, okay. I think I can do that jump. That's why you're there. <laughs> Okay. Similar to my last jump that I failed. And it's because I'm jumping too far, weirdly enough. Like, that's not what I would have expected. Dang it, you're going to go the wrong way. There you go. So, a bit further away than you think. These guys jump far, and Jeff was fed. Alright, I'm just kind of creating a zombie out of common sense. So, he's gonna go underneath there. He's gonna land in the spikes, giving me a nice little footstool. That's, that's really nice. Then, this is gonna happen. As far as I can tell, then just the same thing's gonna happen. Because I need my little footbridge again. Oh, that silly zombie stripping up all over himself! Uh, what a clumsy fool. Alright, now I can go here. I can do this. This gives me access to this. Do you want to put spikes on it? Do I want it lowered? Does it make a difference? Okay. Yes, okay. Yes, it does. It makes a difference because... Okay, this might be like a race. I, I don't know. I really can't tell. Oh, that might be good. That might be good. I don't know if I broke it, or, like, if this is what really is supposed to happen. But, hey, it's all good to me. Alright, here, it's very limited what I have access to. I want something in that battery. I have nothing going for me. I can go back and create a zombie, though. God damn it. Not close the door again. I can just lift it up. It's fine. No, I can't send a zombie because they're always gonna fall in that pit. I cannot send a zombie. That I can tell. 
Like releasing the fire up there just does not matter. That thing up there seems to be on a rail, but I don't know what would affect it. Yeah, how do you move a zombie thing? I don't know. Really don't. Really don't. Really don't know. Because, yeah, because, like, the second, uh, why is that? The second that I affect this, the zombie, the zombie goes away. But now there's a human corpse in it. Will the zombie walk on the human corpse? Maybe he will. Maybe he will. Let's find out together. Okay, maybe I just need more better corpses. I can provide with that. Make a full bridge here. Here we go. Two heads are better than one. That's what they always say. Like, the pile of level is recycle your friends, so... We're gonna take that to its conclusion. We're gonna have a zombie fall here, and then we're gonna put a battery here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now we even got a sweep. Oh, that thing is moving around. Okay, I was waiting for that. Alright, so you, if you want ice, but I need a zombie here. You... You want to mill that ice? I mean, maybe. Oh, you operated that ramp down there. Can you freeze a zombie? Well, I guess there's no reason why not, huh? Alright, okay, well that's fun. Then I can get up here. Alright, okay. Do this. So I'm assuming that the soul gate does something I don't want, so I'm just gonna push you across. Okay, I'm gonna give you a bigger push across. Uh. What does it do? It... It closes this door and instantly burns me. Is that enough? Oh, it's just barely enough. Whoa, that was some physics. All right. All right. I'm stuck. What if he eats me? What if I push him around like a bully? All right, he's doing... Did the level break? Could just jump on him. Alright, post iCube zombie just does not know what to do. Uh, why do I have a lit fire going off? Because I'm still, uh, okay. I can end this all, it's fine. And now he's frozen. Uh, he's dead. I just let him walk all the way there. Yeah, that would be smart. <laughs> Wait, but then what's what did the, the ice cube thing? Was the ice cube? Was I, I don't know. I don't know what was the point of it at this point. Then. All right. Okay. Well, sweet. So you activate this. You move this around. Alright, so I feel like I'm gonna want a zombie up there. Having fun. Over here is a switch that does that. Okay. Oh, do I want a zombie here? Yeah, I need a wait here, but... Oh no, I probably want to put my zombie in there. Okay. Fair. Oh, you... you uh, there we go. You're an awkward one. Alright, so what happens to you, my zombie friend? Oh, no, over here. 
Okay, I want to give you a little ramp. That's cute. Alright, now it's just a dead body. Got it. So I can just do this. Well, when I release it, is it going to start walking around again? Yeah, okay. Wow, you are resilient. I appreciate that trait in my servants. Uh, Alright, then here I'm going to move this back here to serve as my way to clear the flame and die. <laughs> it's fine. I can just go what? whoosh. Maybe? Maybe I can just go whoosh? Like, I don't know if I can jump that flame. Can I just jump that flame? It doesn't look like something I'd be able to jump. Let's try. Eh. I can just jump that flame. Never mind. So that happens. That happens. I need another zombo. So many zombos. Alright, so... Uh, 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 uh. There we go. Alright, so I need to set you up. Alright, and we move on over here. Whoa. Everyone is happy about the state of how do I get up there again? Oh, I lost my zombie in there somehow? How? Alright, because I created a new zombie. Right. Is. Uh, go here, put. Yeah, someone right there. Zombie's gonna have fun. He's just gonna play around, you know, have a good time. Then turn this off. Uh, no, not quite yet. Turn this back on. This might be more complicated. <laughs> Hey, that counts. It's not pretty, but it counts. <laughs> Alright, come on. Here we go. Alright, what's more for the road? So zombie's safe up there. I have plenty of time to set up. This is all the setup I need. He's gonna have a fun ride. Over here. That's not a zombie, right? Nope, it is not. We got a nice big purple string to tell us who's responsible for what. Alright, now just wait for the zombie here. It's gonna open up the door and I'm gonna be done. It did it! Burial, golden halo. Man, this one was some work. Alright. Look at that timer. This guy was... Okay, not gonna lie, I was not aware that I spent 20 minutes at this level. This was a whole session I tacked on. Whoops! I was not aware of it, though. Persistence, indeed. Uh, but, like, yeah, no, like, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't feel it at all. Alright, what's my part-time? Four minute and change, though. Like, less than four minutes. Alright, well, uh... Let's see how this goes. Yeah, like, I cheese this, and I'm not sure what the lesson I was supposed to get was. Uh, that's a problem. Wait a second. I could just do a zombie hop here. Probably, hey. Like, just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. Ah, uh, there we go. No need to deal with this thing. Okay, so you're gonna go here. So yeah, I easily lost my uh, uh, save lives there. Alright, so yeah, I need that initial eyes basically just to do this. Silly and willy. Alright, so just, just get over there. Well, you know what? That works. 
Oh, but I lost lives pointlessly doing this. See, now I've hit par, and yeah, like, I don't think I one corpse is gonna be enough. I don't know what I want, honestly. Yeah, I think I just want to, okay. Get this powered up. Alright. Then I do think we just, like, thaw it here. Like, we just push it through, it thaws, it's fine. And it's gonna hit that switch on the other side. Alright, thanks to going for these things, I actually solve a puzzle. Uh, Alright. You know what? Maybe it, if it is on a door, it's good. Alright, so I've wasted a lot of time here, so I might have lost my time thing. But honestly, like I feel like I'm still learning. So it is above the trap door now. Do I just kinda like do this and I hope it swings into it? Like that's just not working. What am I missing here? And now uh... Like, how- I feel like I did it by accident when I ended up doing it, and like, so I'm back to square one, it feels like. I don't know, like, ah, it's at the end too, like, I just- What I did when I won was a complete fluke. Okay, what do I do then? Maybe. Let's go, Vivian. You're gonna die eventually, but... Let's go, Vivian. try something. It's silly, but I'm, I'm trying it because using my own body in there just doesn't make sense. Like it's finicky in a way the rest of the game just isn't. Right? Like this weird like abuse of physics. Can I just not race it? Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You can just race it. Whoa! Now I'm thinking this was not an expected solution, actually. Because I got a pink clock, and that just does not happen. Well, the important part is it worked! <laughs> Oh man, life just- life. Well yeah, I was gonna say time just kind of flies, but I guess time is life, huh? <laughs>